A city in Japan is trying to generate electricity from snow because, after solar power, it's time to try snow power. The sun and the wind are the two natural phenomena most often harnessed for renewable energy. But one city in northern Japan believes it can tap an overlooked resource that it has in abundance – snow. The city of Omori, which sees heavy snow every year, started a trial in a swimming pool at an abandoned elementary school in December 2022 to explore the feasibility of producing energy by utilizing the temperature between stored snow and the surrounding air. This led to an incredible idea that had the Japanese researchers begin studying methods to create electricity from snow. The idea is to provide a sustainable energy supply and meet any power shortages. Now, that sounds awesome, right? Stay tuned until the end of this video to learn more about this unique technology. Omori is a beautiful city in Japan located 715 kilometers north of Tokyo. Apart from its eye-catching blue pine forests, the city is known for being one of the snowiest places on Earth, receiving about 25 to 26 feet of snow every year. Last year, there was so much snow in the city, the local authorities had to spend about $46 million, which is equivalent to 5.9 billion yen, just to remove it from the buildings and roads. Do you know how the Japanese get rid of this much snow? They collect it and throw it into the sea. Yes, all of it. The process may sound cool at first, but it costs a lot of time, resources, and money. From a Mori based IT startup Forte and the University of Electrocommunications, UEC Tokyo, has promised an interesting solution to the snow problem. They suggest that the extra snow at Amori could be used to generate clean and affordable electric power. Yes, electricity out of snow. And the researchers have already begun testing this idea in the swimming pool of an abandoned school building, as reported by the Japan Times. They also believed their approach might be helpful to many European countries that are currently facing an energy crisis amidst the Russia-Ukraine war. Most such countries in Europe have no shortage of snow, and they could employ it to produce clean energy. Now the question arises, how can snow generate electricity? So, during their study, the Japanese scientists will employ large amounts of snow and outdoor air to power a turbine that generates electricity. The outdoor air obviously has a higher temperature than the air surrounding the snow because it receives some heat from the sun. The researchers will use heat tubes to supply cold air from the stored snow and hot air from the outside to the coolant liquid inside the turbine. The temperature difference between the cold and the hot air will give rise to a convection current in the turbine's coolant. This current will eventually make the turbine rotate and produce electricity. The researchers claim their snow-based power generation method could reach the same efficiency as that of a solar energy plant and possibly in a much more cost-effective manner. The efficiency of this system also depends on the temperature difference factor. The greater the temperature differences, the greater the efficiency of power generation. One of the researchers and a professor at UEC, Koji Inoki, told Nikkei Asia. Interestingly, it's not the first time scientists are trying to generate electricity from snow. For instance, in 2019, a team of researchers from the University of California, Los Angeles, developed a device that could produce electricity from falling snow. This device could only power small devices, though. There have been a few more studies in the past. However, none of these offer a scalable snow power solution like the one proposed by Japanese researchers. If this latest experiment is successful, Japan is planning to use snow power systems for private households, too. Nikkei Asia reports that standalone snow power plants for companies and households will be developed during the test phase. Such snow power plants should also be able to be used by private individuals, as is possible today, for example, with solar power generation. This would reduce power supply problems in winter. As mentioned before, for Forte's boss Jun Kasei, such snow power systems could be a solution for European countries grappling with an energy crisis due to the war in Ukraine. He says that he would like to offer power generation from snow for colder regions in Europe and elsewhere as a low-cost renewable energy generation method with affordable implementation costs. Now, one of the major concerns is the challenges of the snow electricity generation method. Unlike any other renewable energy production method, the snow electricity approach also comes with big challenges. For instance, to make this process scalable, large snow storage facilities will be required. On top of that, Ensuring a continuous supply of hot air in snowy regions could also be tricky for companies operating snow energy plants. 
In conclusion, to get a larger temperature difference, which increases the turbine's performance, experts plan to use the natural heat of local hot springs and the heat of the Earth in the future. If the experiment yields a favorable result, they hope to see the emergence of a whole new industry based on snow recycling. This would prevent power outages in an environmentally friendly way, according to the company. Snow is perceived as a nuisance, but they're hoping to make good use of it. Electricity generation is expected to start in the spring. Two years back, Japan faced its worst electricity crunch in the aftermath of the Fukushima crisis that exposed vulnerabilities in the country's recently liberalized power market. At that time, the power prices in Japan hit record highs last month, as cold snap across Northeast Asia prompted a scramble for supplies of liquefied natural gas, LNG, which is a major fuel for the country's power plants. Power companies urged customers to ration electricity to prevent blackouts, although no outages occurred. That crisis highlighted how many providers were unprepared for such high demand. Experts concluded that the LNG stocks were not topped up ahead of winter, and the heavy snow disabled solar power farms. Now, with this new technology idea of using snow to generate electricity, it can be expected that Japan can come up with a brilliant solution to avoid such an energy crisis again. It also can reduce its dependability on LNG as the major fuel source. And that's all for today, guys. I hope you liked the video, then please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe at the end. And for more such interesting videos on our channel, don't forget to hit that bell icon.